Well, well, well. Why don't you come on in here and tell me a war story? The war between the states. That's what Abner Beach called it. It'd been going on for a year before it really got to us in the upper part of New York State. They called us people in the north that didn't want the war copperheads. We were far from the battles. At least, I thought we were. Copperhead is a Civil War drama. Um, and it's unique in the sense that it's based um, uh, on the home front. It's, it's a story that never leaves this village called Four Corners um, in 1862, upstate New York. Um, and this village is very traditional. Uh, it's kind of untouched by the war, essentially. Um, and when the war arrives, the politics of the war, they start to tear the fabric of the, of the village apart. And it's about how these people who grew up together and who, who are family, it's about how, how politics and grudges and, and, I guess, human nature can tear people apart and how detrimental that can be. I don't want the Constitution dying with them. They say there's been discovered a big conspiracy about secret sympathizers all over the North. Tell the old man and mom I'm going to enlist in the Army. He snuck out behind our backs. It's that story that I don't really think in regards to the Civil War has been told that much. Um, and it's a fascinating period of history. It really is. I had a, I didn't, being British myself, uh, I, didn't, I didn't know a whole, a great deal amount about the Civil War. So for me, it was just fascinating. It's just a really interesting period of history, rapidly changing. Um, it's kind of the definition of America as today. It kind of is, is the, you know, it's, it's what formed the America that we now know. We got... A serpent in our own backyard here. Abner Beach is a copperhead, and the copperhead is a snake. Yep, the copperhead is a snake. Abner Beach is a man. Maybe don't share your notions, maybe he's wrong, but he's a man. My own boy can't tell the difference between a man and a snake. 